This is the Evolution Evo Mag 42. This is a magnetic base drill that can cut up to 42mm holes in metal quite easily using the supplied cutters. You can also fit a normal chuck to this which does enable you to use a traditional drill bit. Compared to other mag base drills this machine is extremely light. Not only that but the actual magnet on this machine is very powerful. These are the types of cutters you can use with this machine, up to 42mm in diameter. These actually have a hole going all the way through the centre for the coolant to go through. And then we have the chuck, the chuck adapter, that simply screws in there. That enables you to use a normal drill bit with this machine. We're just going to start off by screwing in all of the handles. If you've never used a mag drill before, these are very, very handy machines. They can save you a lot of time and a lot of hassle when you're drilling metal on site. You can actually swap the handle over to the opposite side if you wish, which can make the machine easier to use in some applications. And at the back there, we have the switch for the magnet. Once that is switched on, the magnet on it is incredibly powerful on this machine. It is virtually impossible to pull that off. It really is. If you take a look at the cutters you'll see that they have two flats machined on them. That is also when the cutter is in there. There are two grub screws in that part which actually hold the cutter in position. So all you need to do is take the hex key, undo the two grub screws and then ensure the two flats are facing forwards. Insert that in the machine and then tighten up the grub screws. And then this time we'll get the chuck again, ensuring that the two flats align with the two grub screws. Push that up. And again, tighten the two grub screws. So I'll just put a large drill bit in the chuck. This is a blacksmith's drill or a reduced shank drill. I've done this just to demonstrate how to use the machine properly. You will notice that if we lift the handles up fully, the drill bit will not go high enough. So what we need to do is get this lever, undo that, it is actually a left handed thread, and then you can actually get hold of the machine and you can pull that up high enough, and then you can lock that back in position. So once you've lifted it up high enough, you can then just use it as you would do if you're using a cutter, and you can quite simply drill your holes. To fit the coolant bottle it's very simple, simply take the bracket, Slide that over the cap head screw, just tighten that up where you want it. Take the bottle and the screw in valve, screw that on there and simply take that end and push that into the push fit connector there. The machine also comes with a guard that simply fits around the edges there and you can then screw that into position using the wing bolts. I'm now going to take this out on a job and we're going to drill a steel beam for a home extension. So that's the Evolution Evo Mag 42. For the money, that is an absolutely fantastic piece of kit.